200 inch deer are few and far between, and all the work and effort can be ruined in an instant. Looks like someone's found my setup. They pretty much destroyed my setup. Kinda hurts a bit. But determination can put you right back in the game. We all search for it. Some of us work our entire lives to get there, hoping to get that one chance at the deer of a lifetime. And no matter how hard we work, many never will. But we learn along the way that all that work is what we love, what drives the pursuit. We pass on what we know to our children to give birth to their own search and hope with all that preparation and dedication, and sometimes some luck that someday, someday we'll be handed the keys that open a door to a land where legends live. Right when I saw him, I'm like, oh my god, I want him. It's a heavy, crazy cold deer. Extra stickers. Probably the biggest deer I've ever killed. That's pretty neat with those flyers on the front. <laughs> Just an absolutely fantastic deer. He's a gorgeous deer. There's no way a guy could ask for any more. Stealth Cam presents Dean Partridge's Canadian Whitetail. Brought to you by... Ozonics, undetectable, undeniable. Monster Meal, attract, nourish, retain. Excalibur Crossbow, different for a reason. Heater Body Suit, number one in cold weather hunting gear. New archery products, hunt with confidence. Bog, engineered for the unknown. Hoyman, your land, your legacy. Muddy, Serious gear for serious hunters. Glendale 3D Targets, the biggest and toughest 3D targets in the world. Nocturnal lighted knocks, switch on accuracy, and let it glow. Boyd's Hardwood Gun Stocks, better with Boyd's. Raculator, score your trophy fast, easy, and accurate. Old timer knives, built for generations. And by Stealth Cam, proven reliability, proven quality, proven performance. This week we're hunting with Ryan on a freight truck for a huge 200 inch class buck nicknamed the Bigfoot Six. This is a deer that Ryan has plenty of history with. And speaking of history, Ryan has begun to develop quite the history himself of taking giant bucks. When deer like these adorn the walls of someone's home, you know they're doing something right. And you know they have patience, both of which definitely describe Ryan. Like the buck he called Hefty taken in 2014, none have come by chance, luck, or circumstance. In 2015, more work, more dedication landed the huge and untypical that Ryan had nicknamed Trash Can. In 2016 would cap off a run of great bucks with a deer taken with the help of friend Josh. However, targeting big old mature bucks means you won't hang out every year, and for the next couple of seasons Ryan Tag stays in his pocket waiting for the right time, even though having plenty of opportunity. A 2017 season full of nice bucks, but Ryan still waits, not notching his tag. Though not taking a deer, he did film this up and comer, not knowing at the time the part this deer would play in his future. Sounded like 
deer were starting to shed, so I figured I'd check one of my spots here that I was watching all winter, and uh, I just come out of the out of the bush here and got two laying here. <sighs> So not a bad one. I'm assuming that's the match. Yeah, the first sheds of the year, and I know exactly which deer this is. I actually filmed them this past fall. Um, gonna be a nice deer someday. He's got good potential. Heavy up top. Nice curling beam already, so hopefully there's more to come. And there was much more. In 2018, the buck grew significantly. Heavier with a few splits, the potential that this deer had was starting to show, but again put on the safe list for 2018 and again Ryan does not fill his tag. I'm just gonna pack up out of here and that'll be it for the season. Um, I'm now in a two year slump. I've got just under 200 hours in a blind and no shot at a deer, so. When 2019 would roll in, all that time in the blind was about to pay off, in an astronomical way. This segment is brought to you by Hoyman and the new no-slip H-grip on their full line of tools. Best in class tools for every application, Hoyman. Your land, your legacy. This segment has been brought to you by the Heater Body Suit. The Heater Body Suit is the ultimate cold weather hunting garment that allows you to stay on stand longer and sit comfortably. The Heater Body Suit. You stay warm or your money back. Filming this unique buck in 2017, then again passing in 2018, had Ryan excited on what the deer may do now in 2019 if he had survived. Well, it's uh, just the start of uh, our summer here, and uh, we're just heading in to uh, check some stealth cams, see what's on them. Hopefully we got some action. Um, been a nice buck in here in the past, this one area, so hopefully he's back this year and a little bigger and be a little older. And Well, back and bigger is an understatement when Ryan checked his stealth cam. The buck that he had passed had exploded. Long massive beams, splits, and tall tines. He had truly grown into a dream buck. With a plan in place and ample time, Ryan heads in to get set up. A unique feeling it must be, knowing the work that you do now, how you set up, is setting the stage for the hunt of your life. And with everything in place, that stealth cam would continue to capture images of the incredible deer that Ryan would call the Bigfoot Six. With Ryan's plans laid, all that's left is to build the arrows, check the gear, and take a few more practice shots in preparation. Check the camera. Bigfoot 6 has been, he's been day delighting, so time to plan the hunt, I guess, and topped up the monster meal, so. Hopefully got good wind and good conditions tomorrow I can hunt. Hopefully he cooperates and I seal the deal early.
now, but it's early in the afternoon, so hopefully I get about a four hour sit here today. Shortly after getting settled, Ryan has bucks moving early, several young bucks, the possible legends of tomorrow. With this young fellow coming in, Ryan notices the buck behind him. Another very unique deer with heaps of potential, though the day would pass with no sightings of the Bigfoot Six. This segment of Canadian Whitetail is brought to you by Nocturnal Lighted Knox. Nocturnal Lighted Knox, string activated, Simple, switch on accuracy, and let it glow. Canadian Whitetail is also brought to you by Central Boiler Outdoor Furnaces, the ultimate wood heat, Black Eagle Arrows, advanced carbon technology, Tinks, makers of the finest deer lures and scents, Tacticam, share your hunt, Wild Edge, makers of the stepladder, Cyclops, Get out of the dark. Stierka Optics, we see things differently. Elite Archery, the world's most shootable bow. And by Scott Archery. This segment brought to you by AAE. Innovation and integrity is in our blood. Quality and dependability is in our products. In and settled, again bucks are moving early, and again the day passes with no sightings of the Bigfoot Six. And Ryan continues to put his time in, seeing gorgeous young bucks, though his next time out was going to have a very different feel. So we're on uh, day six of our whitetail season and uh, just getting in to the blind here a little late today, but um, looks like someone's found my setup. Kind of figured something was up last night. I heard some quads to the west and uh, yeah, they found it and uh, they pretty much destroyed my setup. It didn't steal anything, which is good. Everything's still here. Blind is completely wrecked. Um, yeah, so. I've never had it happen to me before. I've had cameras stolen, but not uh, an actual setup that's been trashed, so. Kinda hurts a bit. Um, getting pretty late tonight, so I'm not gonna try and set anything up. I uh, made it back to uh, check on Bigfoot 6 and uh, he hasn't been back since uh, the blind got all smashed and everything got thrown out of it. So I decided I'm gonna set it up again, freshen up the monster meal, see what happens. I gotta head back to work, I'll give it a week. Good karma comes around and after resetting, the stealth cam shows Ryan that the Bigfoot 6 is back. And when back from work, Ryan is headed in. Just caught the blind here. And uh, I'm gonna sit for Bigfoot 6. He finally came back. Uh, he's been here twice this week in daylight, early at 5.30 in the afternoon. He was also here yesterday at 5.30. Early, the regular bucks that Ryan had been seeing make appearances, giving hopeful news that there hasn't been too much damage done to the area.
and as evening fades and Ryan begins to plan packing up, he takes one last look to his right. and sees the giant coming his way. An absolutely incredible animal making everything worth it and then some. Something makes the big buck nervous and turns to leave, and Ryan knows that this is his only chance. Welcome to this week's Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment. Locate. Learn. Set up. Hunt. Brought to you by Muddy Outdoors. Gear specifically suited for your application can sure make life easier, like the Block Black crossbow target. The Block Black crossbow features four different target faces more suited to crossbows. The unique target faces offer better aiming references for shooting both close and long range. The Block Black crossbow target also uses a specially designed high density core to stop those hard hitting and high velocity crossbow bolts. Perfectly suited for field points, broadheads, and even expandables, the Block Black crossbow offers very easy bolt removal, which has always been an issue in conventional targets. This week's Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment has been brought to you by Muddy Outdoors. Share your own muddy moment. This segment of Canadian Whitetail has been brought to you by Bog. More than just a shooting rest. Bog, engineered for the unknown. With the bucks moving, Ryan had spotted the giant Bigfoot Six. And as he gets nervous, turns to leave, Ryan spots his chance. I wasn't here with Call Bigfoot 6. I didn't get a complete pass through. I think I hit the opposite shoulder. Brandon's on the way. I'm gonna have a quick look and uh Hopefully we catch up to him here soon. Give the uh, deer we call Bigfoot Six. It'll be a good 40 minutes. We're gonna go look for blood. I'm kind of unsure about the shot, but he was kind of quartered away, and it looked good, but I didn't get a pass through, so we give him some time. So we'll go. We'll see if we can find an arrow and some blood and. Take it from there. Well, here he is, it's Bigfoot Six. We found him. This has got to be the biggest deer I've ever killed in my life. You know, we've been on them since July and kind of went missing here in the last couple weeks, but kind of came back this week while I was away at work. And he's a big deer. Time to get him tagged up and loaded up and get him home. Giant. I think if every hunt was easy, it wouldn't be so special. Adversity creates challenges, and challenges are where there's opportunity for achievements. And what a gorgeous whitetail for such a deserving guy. And congratulations, Ryan, on yet another deer of a lifetime. Thanks for watching this week's episode of Canadian Whitetail. This segment has been brought to you by Wild Edge and the ultimate climbing system, the Stepladder. Safely design your climb in any tree, anywhere, with the most versatile, lightweight, and compact climbing system, the Stepladder. To book your own dream hunt in northern Saskatchewan, please contact us at Canadian Whitetail Outfitters. Canadian Whitetail has also been brought to you by these fine sponsors. 
For exclusive content, follow Dean and the team on Facebook, as well as on Instagram and Twitter, at Whitetail Dean. To view all past and present episodes of Canadian Whitetail, as well as new original content, visit us on our YouTube and Carbon TV channels. For Canadian Whitetail gear and apparel, visit CanadianWhitetailTV.com. Thank you.